Hey, everybody. I'll keep it going. I deserve every minute of it. So it's Earth Day today. Everybody having a good Earth Day out there celebrating? Woohoo! I decided to stop clubbing baby seals because of it. I'm going to start clubbing with seals instead. You know, <laughs> they get all the hot slutty chicks, though, which is good because they have so much in common with one another. They're both used to balancing balls on their nose. And I'm sorry that you just watched me dance. Nobody should see that. It's kind of like opening the ark at the end of the first Indiana Jones movie. <laughs> Don't look, Marion! You'll get that one later, too. So I'm kind of fat. I don't know if you've noticed. You guys in the front, please don't look up my shorts. There's nothing there. But, uh... So, I'm a recovering anorexic. It's been six weeks since I attacked the buffet. And it lost. Going shopping is always an enormous ordeal because you go into the store and you think that you found the item you want. But, of course, it's not in your side. So you take it and you walk up to the counter like, excuse me, um, is this coming? Holy shit! <laughs> Dating is not fun either because you see all these guys who are getting laid that are drinking and doing drugs, but you never once hear a woman say, see that guy over there? Him, the one eating all the cheeseburgers? I'm going to get me some of that tonight. <coughs> And just because I'm fat, don't think I'm not shallow because I do like the skinny hot chicks. I do. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know. It's really funny. But uh, it's not so much because they're hot and skinny. It's because they're not competition. When I'm over at the buffet, I don't want to have to worry about them. So they're over at the salad bar. Come over to the dessert table, though, you're going to lose a limb. I'm just letting you know, forewarning you ahead of time. Because I might eat it. <laughs> so a big problem I have, another strike against me, is I, I was raised Catholic. And uh, I always apologize for everything whenever something bad happens. <coughs> I mean, somebody else could have done it. And I'm really quick to apologize. And this mic stand is not like me. You go back there. Sorry. Sorry. See, I'm apologizing already. But... Uh, I apologize right away, and then I set a lot of cord for six figures. I deny everything. And this is a room full of Catholic people, isn't it? <laughs> I actually had somebody at the last show I did that joke. She came up to me afterwards, and she's like, are you Catholic? Are you really Catholic? Well, I was baptized, and I had my first communion, and then there was the other thing. What was that called? The molestation, yeah. Didn't get a chance to do that part. Kind of missing out. So if you guys seen in the news recently, there is a study that shows if you have a low IQ, you are more prone to having heart disease. It's on the internet, it's gotta be true. So I have a list of people that I'd like to say goodbye to ahead of time. NASCAR fans. <laughs> Anybody who's ever been on Cops or Cheaters, so that's kind of a whole thing. The Bush administration. Sarah Palin. I'm really going to miss that one, but I'll always have my sock. Scientologists. People who are way too into Mafia on Facebook. And uh, people who don't get this joke. My name is Ron. You guys have been great. <laughs>